importance of education cannot be overemphasized. It helps in the adaptation to grow and develop. To support the education of indigents within the council area, the leadership of Orili Agege Local Council Development Area, led by Baba Tunde Johnson, distributed free educational materials to pupils. In attendance were the council leadership, management staff, students and residents of Orili Agege LCDA. Chairman Johnson disclosed that it is important to properly equip the youths of today because they are the future leaders. So we are laying a very solid foundation for you. And the foundation we are laying for these children is of utmost importance to our administration. As a government that is passionate and committed towards delivering the dividends of democracy to its people, education is one of the focal points of our administration. We have left no stone on top in this regard by investing in educational legacies and giving our future leaders a solid foundation that will stand the test of, test of time, boost their morale and uh, mold them into great personalities that will make them stand before kings and not before mean men. That is the more reason we went back on total rehabilitation, total rehabilitation of all schools in Orile Agege. And we are left with just two to go. Ibukolu Primary School and Ori Fair, we are left with those two. And by the grace of God, before the expiration of this administration, the needed infrastructure to be put in place, we put it in place there. I also want to assure you that our government will continue to throw the line of the team's agenda of our Mabu Governor, Mr. Babajide Olushola Sonwolu, while lifting the flag of our party, the All Progressive Congress Aya. Some of the guests at the event lauded the chairman's initiative, stressing that education leads to success. It's doing great for these people. In the area of renovation of the school, is marvelous. And concerning the distribution of uh, furniture to the people, is doing wonderful. And today, it's living, it's giving a free book, writing materials to these people to enhance their learning in the school, in Orile Agege LCDA. So it's very marvelous in our sites. My advice for the parents is for them to know that, to use, uh, to use this period to, to support the, the, the chairman and to do everything, make everything possible, to announce to the people that the primary school in Agege is more better than even the private schools now because we have buildings and they are giving them materials, they are giving them back from the suburb, the, the government, they are really supporting the parents. So if they can help us with this, I, I think by the next time, the purpose will be more than this in this school. The council Hemsman further discloses that the writing materials is a form of palliative to cushion the effect of subsidy removal adding that providing a conducive learning environment for public schools pupils is paramount to his administration. It is uh, giving back to the society. We are passing through a very difficult time in Nigeria as of today. But passing through this difficult situation, palliative is not only meant for food items. We've given them theory exercise book and writing material. This goes a long way to some of these parents who could not afford it. We are not resting on our oars concerning that. You can see the structures. You can see the structure we have put in place. You can see the conducive learning environment is to encourage these children. Security is not only when you touch it on the surface. Security starts with the children. If the children are responsible, they won't become vagabond. If they have Western education, they are enlightened, they are civilized. They will know their right from their left. So that is the exact thing that every meaningful government should know that we should invest so much on the life of these children. And that is exactly what we are doing now. Investing in their tomorrow, in encouraging them, let them be encouraged, let them, let them feel proud. I think have you visited their toilet? You can see the kind of toilet we have provided for the children. You cannot, you cannot. In fact, this toilet can compete with any toilet, any university toilet. I repeat, primary school toilet that we have provided can compete with any other institution toilet. 
their classroom can compete with any classroom in any of the school. You can see it. We are telling them that they are their prince and princess. You can see their, 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 their building. Looking at see if it's a palace is to encourage them, is to give them sense of belonging. The population of this school is about 550. We've distributed 550 to this school. We are distributed to all the schools in Dorila Gege. We have 24 primary schools. We are going from here, here now, we are moving to the next point of call, which is St. Peter and some Okeko to primary school. I mean, all the schools within that complex. With this kind of initiative, there is hope of a better tomorrow for the pupils. Thank you.